obviously back to having VAR used as the Champions League. What do you think would have happened on Sunday if VAR had been used in Burnley's first goal? Uh, first of all, sorry for my English. Not good enough, but I will try <laughs> my best. Uh, I think uh, the VAR is here for help, everyone, and uh, to help the referee on his decision. But uh, he needs to take the decision, so I don't know uh, what the, the referee think about that, uh, that moment. For me, it was a clearly, clearly foul. Uh, I think for the most of people I spoke with him, it was foul. But uh, I don't know about the, the, the referee, so it was his decision, and we need to respect this. And with regard to the title race back home, the fact that you trail City by a point now, what has that done to the mood and the spirit within the camp? Don't change nothing. Uh, we have our goals and we are fighting for it. Uh, our goal is win the, the league and everything we are playing, the Champions League as well. So we are fighting uh, the spirit of this, this team. Uh, it's it's uh, a great thing. So we are focusing in, the, in this next, next game. It's a, a challenge for us. So what do you say to those then who believe that if you were to go out of the Champions League, it would actually help your chances of winning the Premier League? No, we, we can choose what, uh, what we go for. We can choose, but uh, we choose both. So, uh, there are two big competitions. Uh, of course, Premier League is a long time that uh, Liverpool don't, don't win, never win the, the Premier League. Uh, with this name, uh, so we'll fight for both. That's what I, I say for, for, for those ones. Can I have water, please? Hi, uh, Philip Nagel from uh, ARD. I would like to know, in uh, Germany, Jürgen Klopp has a lot of fans, and not only in Dortmund or Mainz, especially of his art. I would like to know from you, uh, do you think also that Jürgen Klopp is a humoristic person, as I said, he has humor, and what characterizes uh, Jürgen Klopp also? Yeah, he's a, a funny guy, but at, outside the, the, the pitch, uh, inside the pitch, inside the time of work, he's pretty serious and uh, a passionate guy for football so i think he he put this this thing on 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 us in the pitch and he give his passion uh, for me and for my teammates uh, in the game so this is very good in what makes him a funny person you say he's a funny guy so maybe you can explain it a little bit he's a funny guy because he's a great guy. He's a good guy. He, I think the way he he go he he deal with everyone. He he treat us. Uh, I think uh, like his own sons, and he treat everyone uh, as uh, as we call in the dress room, uh, the staff, everyone. So this this I think make his special uh, a special person for us. Chris. Um, in the opposite goal tomorrow night, it's Manuel Noah, one of the other top goalkeepers in the world. Does being one of the best keepers in the world, is that something that motivates you? And, and how do you compare yourself with, with Manuel? Oh, I can compare myself with uh, Noah. He's one of the best uh, in the last 10 years. Maybe he's the best one. Um, he won everything and I'm just starting so he's a reference for me uh, and he's a great guy as well I uh, play against him is a pleasure for me and uh, he's a dream coming true so I think I can compare myself with him Does that being one of the best in the world is that something you think about is that something goalkeepers think about or do you just focus on your own, own job? I, 
I think, I believe this is a consequence of what we do in the pitch, uh, in uh, the training, training ground every day. We need to, I, I work hard. I know I have worked hard. I'm part of a big club who have big plans, who have uh, big goals. So I need to take this responsibility and take care of it. And for, for this, I need to, to give my, my best, my 100% uh, on the pitch. So this uh, be the best in the world will be a consequence of this. Okay, let's go right back. I uh, just wonder if you can tell us what it's been like playing behind Virgil van Dijk this season and what you see as his strengths and how important it is to have him back to play here in the second leg. Sorry, the second? And how important it is for him to be back from suspension for the second leg. It's great to play with him um, and with all my teammates. Our, our team have uh, so many players with a lot of quality. Uh, but Van Dijk is uh, a very, very important uh, player for our team uh, in the way we played. He gave uh, consistency for, for our team, uh, defending, um, high balls, uh, corners, uh, set pieces. He is important for us and uh, it's very important to count with him for the, this second game. I think Fabinho uh, play well like central back, but is the isn't the the, the same thing. He's a, a great midfielder and just a good central back. So if you can uh, have uh, uh, the best in, on the the position for us, it's always better. Okay. Any further questions? Yeah, gentleman down there. Thank you. <clears throat> Tomorrow you are going to meet uh, one of the best strikers or number nine in the world. He's a uh, top goal scorer in Bundesliga and also in the Champions League. How do you prepare um, to meet Lewandowski tomorrow? Like we prepare to, to, to meet every, every player. He's uh, a great striker, maybe one of the best of the world. Uh, I like his style. Uh, I like the way he moves in the in the pitch. So we need to be very concentrated to to try to stop him, to try to stop the other players. Uh, so I think it will be a, a great game, and we are prepared for it. Have you also prepared for a penalty or a shootout in the end? Uh, we are prepared for for the game, and we know uh, the penalty penalty can happen so we will try to 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 come back with the uh, the qualification for the next stage but uh, the 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 way it goes uh, I don't know so we are prepared for everything tomorrow night okay any final questions no okay thank you very much everyone thank you